An unbelievable update to a story we've been following for nearly a week now. A family's beloved dog just disappears. They do everything they can to find it, even hiring a search team and putting up a billboard. Well, it turns out their dog was right under their nose the whole time. Our Ryan Raish is live tonight with the details we're now learning about. Ryan? Yeah, it's hard to find anyone here in Lakeland who did not know about this missing dog. There's signs like this one posted behind me all over town. People in this community really connected with the beautiful golden retriever and ultimately helped find her. <laughs> dog lovers can relate. Missing for three exhausting weeks, the McFarland family finally got their sweet girl Sophie back. <laughs> <laughs> but this missing dog tale is unlike most you've ever heard. One that involved a huge billboard, an airplane banner, countless posters, a search and rescue team, and eventually even the police. It turns out Sophie wasn't actually lost. She was stolen. This dog was picked up and taken and was not going to come back home. It was, it was basically finders keepers. After we took action with our story last week, the family got dozens of tips, one of them leading to a woman who lives nearby. Attorneys and detectives got involved, and just today, all parties reached an agreement. The family would not press charges or publicly embarrass the lady if she just turned Sophie over. That's all they ever wanted. Finally, the folks that had the dog uh, made the correct decision to give the dog back, and yeah, so here we are. Leading up to this happy reunion, there have been plenty of letdowns. Peter and his friend Blaine have showed up at several places thinking they found Sophie, only to find a similar golden retriever. <laughs> I'm a nervous wreck. But this time was different. This time, Sophie's coming home. If the little pieces went to add it up, there's no way this dog comes home. Sit, Sophie. The family really wanted to thank the community for its outpouring of support and also the Lakeland Police detectives who helped find their missing dog. Before Sophie left the vet's office and went home with the family, she received a microchip. So hopefully this never happens again. Live in Lakeland, Ryan Reich, ABC Action News.